What's up guys, it's Michael from iAppleTech.com. Today we're going to be taking a look at a Mac application called Snappel, Snapheel, however you want to pronounce it. It was sent out to me for review from the makers of it, and I want to thank them for sending out for review because it is an awesome, awesome application, and I can't wait to show you guys. So let's go ahead and load up an image here, and I will show you guys what this thing can do. It's really, really cool actually. So um, basically what it does is it takes unwanted objects and erases them from the picture completely. It's really, really cool. So I just have an example picture here. This is, I mean, most people don't take a picture of an iPad, a Kindle, and a Canon case camera, but I did. Um, okay, but basically what's, what I want to do is I just want to get this iPad in the shot. I don't want the Kindle Fire or the Kindle Touch or the Canon Cap. So let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and show you just a little bit around the application. Over here we have import to import a picture. To load a picture, load photo. You can save it, you can share it, you can fit it to the screen. So let's go ahead and zoom in. Fit to screen, fits it to the screen right away. Uh, we can make it bigger. Zoom in, zoom out. We can hit actual size. I'm gonna zoom out because I don't want it that big right now. Oh, we have an undo and redo button. Over here we have erase, clone and stamp, retouch, uh, adjust, which is like color correction, uh, crop, and uh, of course rotate. So let's go ahead and just go to erase. Let me show you guys the main point of this application. So basically, like I said, it completely erases unwanted object objects from the picture. So let's go ahead and select this. And to select, it's really easy. All you gotta do is hold down the mouse or you can just tap like this. And there, we got that selected. Let's say we make a mistake. Let's say we didn't want that there. We can hit deselect and we can erase that. And again, you can either hold down the mouse or you can just click just like that. Either way, it'll work. Um, and that works for both select and deselect the clicking and holding. We also have pan, which allows you to move around the object if you're zoomed in too far. Uh, let's go ahead and also select the Kindle Fire now. And I'm going to hit select and just the diameter of the brush to be a little bit bigger because it is a bigger object. Go ahead and select this and of course if you get in really far and zoom in really close it's going to look better but this is a video demonstration not a professional picture that i'm even going to worry about so um that's just gonna have to do all right so that should be good uh we'll see how that turns out here now what we're going to want to do is go down here and we're going to have three type of erase modes. We're going to have wormhole, which basically works works for uh, skin imperfections. So like if you have pimples or something, we also have shape shifter, which works best for what I'm going to do, bigger objects and uh, twister, which uh, just works for uh, objects in the sky, smaller objects, stuff like that. So let's go ahead and do shape shifter and hit erase here and it's going to work its magic. Hopefully it won't take too long. Okay, so this is taking a little bit longer than normal. Usually it goes a little bit faster. Uh, I can't really tell you exactly why it goes faster and slower at times. It just does. Um, but one thing is nice about it is what, when it is loading, it gives you these uh, little facts, which is kind of, I don't know, kind of cool. Just a little bonus uh, for getting the app. By the way, I forgot to mention the app is $15 in the Mac App Store, uh, and it is worth it. I'm telling you, this is an awesome, awesome app. So here we go, we're done, and you can see the Canon camera is completely gone. It just basically disappeared. We still have a little bit of residue, or just a little bit of showing from the uh, Kindle. So I'm actually what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go ahead and just go all out here and just select the whole thing and see what happens. I'm also gonna select, uh, you guys can see on the carpet here, it's a little little dark spot here, like a little stain or something. So let's go ahead and select that and just see what it can do. Hit erase again and hopefully this won't be long again, but we never know. All right, so it didn't take too long. Uh, it took a little bit long though, so I just wanted to cut the video there, but as you can see, the uh, things are completely gone and I didn't do any sort of editing. Uh, that is completely the application itself. I wanna show you one more picture here and just one more quick example just so you guys can see how awesome this thing is. So let's go ahead and load a photo here. So I just found this picture online. I don't know who this chick is, but she's got some pimples going on and she's got some uh, cream on her face or something. So let's go ahead and remove that. Let's go ahead and uh, I'm gonna zoom in really far this time. So see if I can show you guys exactly how this uh, amazingly works as long as you take your time on it so we're just going to select this here just like that maybe you go over a little bit you can kind of see a little bit of the shadow so we're going to want to get that too just get all the pixels in there and that's about good 
that should work. Now let's go ahead and uh, go over here to this one and uh, select this one just like this. And this actually works really cool. You guys are going to be amazed, I promise. You're going to be like, whoa, where'd it go? Where'd the pimples go? I don't know. It's amazing. It's unique patent pending technology and it's awesome. Go over to the last one here, select it just like this. Get the shadows on her face. Go ahead and go down a little bit there. And we'll have to get these last few pixels. Actually may have went over a little bit, but I'm sure this video is long enough. But I really wanted to show you guys just how awesome this application is. So let's go ahead and hit uh, the wormhole now, which works the best with skin imperfections. Hit erase. Boom is gone and you guys can see there I didn't do any sort of fancy editing it was just gone right away we can undo 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 keep undoing let me just keep undoing and you guys be able to see that this is all non-edited you can see the red going away let's go ahead and hit redo again and you'll see the red going back on the pimples so now we are going back on the last pimple you can see the red there and this is no editing at all I'm literally just clicking the mouse there and then we hit undo, we can hit redo, or let's just hit erase again. Boom, just like that. Undo, erase, it's gonna erase everything. The pimples are gone, and she looks like she's never had any pimples in her life, and now she just looks sad. So it's an awesome, awesome application. I would highly, highly recommend checking it out, especially for $15. They said the price will be going up once they release a new version, so get it now while it's only $15. It is unfortunately only on the Mac. Sorry, PC guys. I don't know if they're going to bring it to the PC or not, but right now it is only on the Mac. But as you can see, it works awesome. It's like magic. It's unique patent, patent pending technology. I've said that three times, and I think I've only gotten it right twice. Unique patent pending technology. And uh, yeah, go check it out in the Mac App Store. I have a link in the description below to buy it. And otherwise, that's it. I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching.